Malacanang condemned the killing of Mayor Halili. Presidential spokesperson Harry Roque described Halili as a staunch ally of the government's war against the drug menace. The palace vowed justice for the city mayor's death. Rocky Ignacio has this report. Malacanang condemned the killing of Tanawan Batangas Mayor Antonio Halili. In a press briefing in Maasim Leyte, Presidential Spokesperson Harry Roque condoled with the family of slain Tanawan Mayor. Roque said the administration recognizes Halili's leadership to bring progress to his constituents. Kinukondina po natin ang ganitong karahasan. Um, kinikilala po natin si Mayor um, Halili bilang mayor na isa sa pinakaprogresibong bayan ng Batangas Yan po ang tanawan at nangangako po ang palasyo na bibigyan ng katarungan ng kanyang pagkamatay, magkakaroon po ng mabilis ang investigasyon at paglilitis doon sa mga tao na responsable sa pagpatay nito. The palace official gives emphasis that there is time to discuss the slain mayor's alleged involvement in the operations of illegal drugs. Halili was known for his shame campaign against those involved in illegal drugs. Hindi ko po alam. Pero hindi pa po natin alam kung bakit napatay si uh, Mayor Halili. Um, si Mayor Halili po, nakilala siya dahil meron siyang shame campaign laban po sa mga drug pushers. He added authorities will conduct a thorough investigation on the killing of Halili. Pero at the same time, meron pong ganun ang record na nasa narcolist po siya. Pero tingin ko po, walang basihan para mag-conclude ngayon kasi wala pang investigasyon. Antayin po natin ang investigasyon. Police supervision was removed from Halili by the Napolcom due to his alleged involvement in illegal drugs. Aside from illegal drugs, Roque said the government has intensified its campaign against criminality, and that includes the implementation of anti-tambay. He issued a statement amidst concern of Senator Pamphilo Lacson that crime happened even broad daylight. Rocky Ignacio for The Nation.